Hello, my name is Emmanuel. I'm from Amazing Foundation Ministries International Kids Corner. And today, I'm going to be talking to you about the Ten Commandments. The Ten Commandments is in Exodus chapter 20. But the one that I'm going to be talking about today is loving your neighbour as, your, as yourself. Imagine if you went to your friend's house or someone you know and you went to their house. And then after that, um, you had a sleepover there. In the midnight, you saw them sneaking into your bag and taking out your to and taking out your toys and putting them in their bag instead, stealing. And you, then after then after that you go then after that you go to them and tell them, "Hey, why are you stealing my toys?" And they're like, "No, I'm not stealing their toys." And they're like, "Oh, I need to go. Bye bye." And they run off. What would you do? Will you run after them, shouting at them, saying, Go away! I don't need you ever again. I'll, next time I'll go to your house and snoop inside your cupboards, take your stuff, eat your sweets, steal your toys and eat your crisps. Would you do that? Or would you pray for them and ask God to forgive them and to stop them from doing it? Think to yourself, what would you do? Personally, for me, I'll run after them shouting, Give me back my toys! Give me back my toys! Give me my sweets! Give me my chocolates! Give it back! But when I get back home and I end up not getting it, I'll go back home and I'll stop praying for them saying, Oh God, please forgive them and... And make them return my toy back in Jesus' name. And I'll make prayers over that. What would you do? Now, I'm going to tell you this Bible chapter that you can read at home by yourself. It's very, very interesting. It talks about this person who, want, who knows all of the Ten Commandments who's done most of the important Ten Commandments and he wants to go higher in his faith but he doesn't know how so he asked Jesus it said Matthew chapter 19 16 to 16 to the end of the chapter and now I am going to talk to you about being nice as well being nice is basically loving your neighbor as yourself it's basically the same thing because if you come back to your friend's house after what they've done to you and instead of being nice to them and saying oh are you okay how how are you how are you doing are you okay have enough instead of that you just you just go after them saying and you think in your mind, I'm going to steal in their cupboards, eat their biscuits, scrumble their papers, eat their chocolates, and have all of their ice creams. And eat it all up. Or would, would you do that or be nice to them and uh, be nice to them and tell them why it's not good to do all of those bad stuff that he did last na last time you were, were there. Think to yourself, what would you choose? It doesn't have to be out of those options. You can have something else like you want to do, like tell their parents off of them, or, or maybe even calling the police. <laughs> but... This is one thing that I want you to learn today. Love your neighbour and be nice to them. I hope you enjoyed today's ministry. And, today, and don't forget to read the Bible chapter. The Bible is very important. Read it and you will learn from it supernaturally. Bye!